Hello, my dear. Rhonda Constant, your favorite hometown medium, physical energy healer, oracle card advisor, paranormal investigator, voice for your loved ones. How are you today? So, I think I've done readings for you before, but I like to remind people this is not an exact science. We communicate the best way we can. There's always a reason for the for whatever they show or say. So if it doesn't make any sense now, keep it in mind. You'll either see it later, remember it later, somebody else will validate it for you later. They never waste a message. They don't waste their energy. So there's always a reason for whatever comes out. And you might have to stretch it outside the box. I may not have it exact, like the way you need to hear it, but I try to describe it the best I can. I <laughs> All I keep hearing is, mom, mom, mom. Mom, 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 mom. What's that annoying little cartoon character on TV? Oh, Stewie. I don't know if that's the right name or not because I can't stand to watch it because it goes mom, 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 mom. That's what he's doing. And that's what he's doing, flashing you all that stuff. It's the same thing. Mom, 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 mom. You ask for signs, you ask for them. Um, He, <laughs> he is a little over the top, but he thought that's what you wanted. He's still going, mom, 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 mom. So he's, he's not really saying that he wanted anything in particular. He just thought you needed to know that he was there, that he can hear you. He can see you. Promise you a thousand percent. So tell him if he's annoying you after nine o'clock at night when you're trying to sleep, say mm, off limits. No, don't do that anymore. If, if there's a, I'll just pick a repeating number, a repeating number, the same number, not, well, I don't, if it's like one, two, three, four, and then you see one, two, three, four, and then you see one, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Go Google angel numbers, one, two, three, four. Whatever those, whatever that set of numbers is that is always exact, go Google angel numbers. There'll be a message in there for you. So he, he's trying to find his own way to communicate with you. He says, stop poo-pooing me. Like, He's enjoying the shit out of it. Yeah. So, <laughs> he keeps stopping me. Um, if you want him to tone his energy down, tell him. But most people beg for what you're getting. Most people would just be over the top excited if their loved one came through as much and as clear as your son. So now that he says, I am okay. I am okay. I'm having fun. Now he's saying one, two, three, four, but I don't think those were the numbers that you gave me. So what, anyway. And he's saying, he's saying one, two, three, four, over and over and over and over. But that, don't Google that because I made that up. He will do, well, I should say probably, they usually do what you ask him to do. If he's being over the top, tell him back off a little bit. Like um, sometimes when Bob, like one time he wanted my attention, it felt like a pin, like a needle sticking me in my chest. It's like, hey, that's a little much. I know I wasn't paying attention. So he's trying to get your attention. He says, smoke on the horizon. And it's almost like I'm seeing smoke like off over a hill. I don't know. Did somebody's house burn recently that you know? Or did you see somebody's house off far away? burning. I don't, I'm not sure what he's trying to show me with this. It's like a hill and you can see this big cloud of smoke just billowing up like over the over the hill. 
I don't know if he's trying to validate that it's him or validate that he knows this. Oh, and sorry, I did want to chip in here in the beginning and say, I apologize for taking so long. You can still see some of the bruising, but I decided I can suck that up. But everything was swollen, black, purple, green, red. It was, I looked like a creature. So I appreciate you being patient, and I'm, I never have a problem giving, any, giving anybody a refund because I'm not in this for the money, or I'd be charging a lot more than I am. So anyway, thank you. Thank you for being patient. Something about clarifying something. He's trying to clarify something. But he said he wants you to get it. He doesn't want to tell me he wants you to get it. I hate when they do that. <laughs> He's trying to get it to come through crystal clear so he can communicate with you. Why are you trying to shut me out? Give him, give him, if it's a time frame that's bothering you, say, okay, you can't come in before six o'clock in the morning and you can't come in after nine o'clock at night when I'm trying to sleep. Or I'm watching a movie right now. Sit down there next to me and watch it with me and be quiet. He's like poking. He's poking on you too. He's poking. He's poking on your arm. He's poking on the side of your leg. So know when you feel that poking or he's trying really hard. So it could feel like pins, like pins sticking you like Bob did me. When they try hard enough. So again, if he pokes too hard, if he makes it hurt, sometimes they don't realize that it hurts. So you go, hey, um, tell him, hey, that was a little strong, that hurt. It's almost like he doesn't want you forgetting. It's almost like he's trying to stay next to your energy. Like, don't forget me. Don't forget. Don't forget I'm here. Don't forget I existed. Don't forget I'm still here. It's, it, it's all in the works. It's all in the works. It's happening. Don't know what he's talking about. It's all in the works. It's happening. All right, now he's saying something like Harry, Carry, Fairy. And I mean all three words, not, not just one similar word. He said Harry, Carry, Fairy. Mm -hmm. Don't know. Uh, Harry, Carry, Fairy. Talking about something tribal. Tribe, T R I B A L. Tribal like Indians, tribal like a clan, tribal. So I don't know if he's trying to say three separate people or what he's, what's, oh, I don't know. I, I hate when they're so, uh, so uh, vague. Sorry. So I don't know if you need to take those very carry fairy. You need to stretch those out of the box and somebody's name's close to that or exactly where we're going with all that tribal tribal want to maybe be native american i don't know something when i when i hear tribal i think native american it could mean something else for you Okay, so he wanted me to pull a card from my new deck. They do that sometimes. And uh, some things are better left unknown. So there's something you're wanting to know about, 
And sometimes it's just better to let it go, let it be, and just accept what is or what was. He's not saying what direction he's talking about, what, what, um, should it be category? Maybe it's what I want to say that he's talking about. It's something you've been wondering about, something you want to know the answer to. Mm -hmm. Just let it go and accept it as it is. He's talking about an apple, apple like you eat. So either you just had an apple, you just bought some, thinking about getting some. He loved apples, not sure where he's going with that. Or watch for one to roll off your kitchen counter. Or fall in front of you at the store. I think he's pretty, he's pretty good about being able to ma manipulate some stuff. He's kind of got, he's got, well, it's easy for the young ones <laughs> to figure shit out. He says, Mom, your hair looks pretty. And he's kind of going like this with his, like poofing it up. <coughs> Excuse me. But he says, your hair looks pretty. So you've recently done something different to it. Or maybe you're getting ready to, and he kind of likes it the way it is. It's your choice, not his. But he's just complimenting you. He says something about back in the day. He's just kind of hopping around with words. He can do whatever he wants. It's his show. Okay, this is weird. He's he's showing me like he's got his head up like this and he's screeching a song out, not singing. He's screeching in how do I describe this? I can't even hear a melody. Can't even tell. He says true story. T R U E story. I don't know that that's the name of a song, but there might be a song similar to that name. But it's like it's like he's doing it comical, like on purpose, that he's doing this screeching, howling type of, I don't know if he used to do something like that, or you're going to hear somebody doing that. You might, you might be walking through the store and you might hear some little kid doing that. It's, but it's more like he's, he's being, he's being silly about it. Or you might be watching a movie. You might see somebody doing that. Um, maybe he used to do that. Or maybe he used to do it when he was younger. It's almost like he's stretching his neck out. Like, got his head up like a dog would. Like a coyote would have his head up howling at the moon. But he's not really howling. Again, he says, true story. <laughs> Now he's going like this, like he's up to something. He's up to something. Have no clue. He's ornery. He's good. He's smiling. He's laughing. Some people didn't think I'd be able to do it. And he's talking about something like what he's doing now on the other side, like I think he's talking about the communicating back. Some people didn't think I'd be able to do it. Don't you still love me? I still love you. Half of one, six of the other. Six of one, half a dozen of the other. I think's what he's trying to say. He says half of one, six of other, which is... Six of one, half a dozen of the other. I don't know. I just repeat what comes from him within reason. Mm. 
know that things are going to be okay. It's almost like, it's almost like he's shown me that your mind is kind of maybe garbled, garbled up at times, like, like a lot of confusion at times. He says, but it will be okay. Okay. So know that I love you, Mom, and I'm missing you. <laughs> okay. There's another deck of cards sitting here. Another I, I don't know why I got two new decks. I haven't really been playing with cards lately. Well, it's not playing, it's serious, but you working with them, let's say it that way. And and I don't ever just cut the deck and pull one up, but that's what he wanted me to do. And it says, unusual preferences. They could have an interest for engaging in something that is not considered mainstream. Secrets. Well, that, whoops, let me get my fat finger out of the way. Well, that's what he's doing right now with communicating with you so much. He's doing something that is not considered mainstream. <laughs> And I don't know, I don't know if that's actually a secret, but that's just, uh, and it is unusual, but, uh, and that's cute. So maybe you haven't told anybody that he's doing that. So maybe it is a secret. Yeah. I don't, I don't tell everybody what I do. Cause then they go, you're batshit crazy. <laughs> well, I am. Who cares? Okay, with that, he's going to leave. Wait till you see what I do next. Like I said, if if he's going coming full on too much, just tell him so nicely. We don't want to hurt his feelings. Well, once we're up there, we don't have all those kinds of feelings like that. It's it's Our feelings are totally different because we don't have any of the negative shit. Just remember, I love you. And I'm always around and you know it. Bye. See you later. He just, he just pops up. Bye. See you later. And with that, he's leaving. Thank you, my dear, for being so patient. Thank you for understanding. You know, us women got bruises all down here. I don't like to be seen. I hid in my house for quite a while. See you later. Much love to you. Rhonda Constant, your favorite hometown medium, physical energy healer, oracle card advisor, paranormal investigator, voice for your loved ones. Later.